Kia ora and welcome along to the Met Service Severe Weather Update for today, Thursday the 20th of July. As you can see on the satellite picture, we've got a fair bit of cloud waiting out towards the north and the west of the country. That's going to be moving in towards the likes of Northland and Auckland as we head through the afternoon, bringing with it some heavy rainfall, some strengthening winds. And as we go through the next day or so, we're going to find that wet weather transfers place like the Coromandel, also this eastern coast as well. So there are a fair number of severe weather watches and a few warnings in place as we go through the rest of today and on in towards Friday and Saturday. Here's how things are evolving through the daytime. That area of low pressure brings that wet weather in towards Northland, Auckland, the Coromandel, in towards parts of the Bay of Plenty, and that eastern coast, Hyrapti, in towards Hawke's Bay as we head through Thursday to Friday. And it still lingers around that eastern coast, even into towards the weekend as well, Saturday and Sunday. And accompanying that, some pretty strong winds as well. The strongest winds here picked out by those orange and red arrows. You can see northeasterlies in towards the likes of Northland and Auckland this afternoon, turning more southeasterly across the north. Now you can see a rather windy story pretty much for all of us as we go through the daytime there. So there are some watches not just on the North Island, but also for that top of the South Island, places like Marlborough, Blen uh, uh, Buller, and even down in towards that parts of Westland as well. Some stronger east or southeasterly winds with us as this system sticks with us as we go in towards the weekend as well. Now these warnings and watches are all for different times. They start off in the north. You can see that heavy rainfall coming through there, feeding on towards the eastern coast and those watches down towards the south. It will start off with those ones that are likely to happen at first. It's those watches and warnings up across the northern parts of the country. So these are the severe weather watches for the heavy rainfall through Northland and in towards Auckland from this afternoon for Thursday through towards uh, the end of the night for, say, Northland and through into the early hours of the morning for Auckland. Now for Auckland, that rainfall perhaps arriving really in towards the city after dark and in towards the early hours of the morning. But some heavy bursts of rainfall, perhaps even the odd downpour, particularly across these eastern parts of the region as we head out through the nighttime. There is also a warning out for heavy rainfall as we go through towards the end of the day today for Thursday, 10 p.m. on Thursday, right the way through towards 10 p.m. on Friday. And rainfall totals through the Coromandel could be as much as 120 to 150 millimeters of rain. So there is a fair amount of rain to come through and that rain has been pushed in by some pretty strong winds as well. So we have got some severe weather watches as well for those winds. Again, similar kind of times for Northland and Auckland later on today through and towards the early hours of Friday. And there's also a wind watch in place for those western parts of the Coromandel down towards the Kaimai range as well. So in towards those northern parts of Waikato, some strengthening winds, perhaps reaching gale or even severe gale in the most exposed areas as we go through the rest of today and through in towards the nighttime as well. But it's not just up in the north and western parts of the country. Down towards that eastern coast, we've got more heavy rain in, in store for the likes of Tairafti, particularly those areas north of Tolaga Bay. And in terms of rainfall totals, 100 to 130 millimetres of rainfall. So again, a fair bit of wet weather right the way from Friday, right the way in towards Saturday. We've also got a watch in place for those areas in Hawke's Bay, particularly the Wairoa district, and in towards the ranges through there. Again, may just reach warning criteria, particularly later on, uh, well, in towards the early hours of Friday and in through towards the early hours of Saturday as well. Still, I think some wet weather with us through towards Sunday as well, but just working out where it's going to be is a tricky part. We've also got a severe weather watch out for some strengthening southeasterly winds through those eastern parts of the Bay of Plenty, south and east of Fakatane. Again, as we go through towards the afternoon on Friday in towards those early hours of Saturday morning. And like I said, it's not just the North Island. We are also going to find our winds increasing down on the South Island through parts of Marlborough, parts of Nelson and Tasman, and down towards Buller, and even in towards parts of Western North about Hokitika later on on, say, Friday. So really from the early hours of Friday morning right the way through in towards Saturday. Those southeasterly winds perhaps reaching severe gale in the most exposed areas, squeezing towards places like Greymouth as well. So do keep an eye on the forecast and on your latest severe weather watches and warnings. And you can find all of that at metservice.com.